What do you personally think of when you think of women? Okay, um, I think about all the things you'd expect me to think yeah, about. Yeah, none of that. Well... What comes first? Looks. Looks come first. Always. I subconsciously judge women in my mind. No matter who they are, no matter what they wear, no matter how old. I literally see numbers on people as they walk. And I scale them accordingly. And what happens next? Well, I think about how to communicate with them. So if a girl's attractive, I'm probably going to act warmer. My posture will change. I'll look her in the eyes. I don't know, I'm just bubblier. And why are you guys together? I'm just asking. As a friend. You want an answer? Loyalty. She was loyal. I mean, everything grew from there. It just... grew from there. That's an answer? That's the answer. For loyalty, you buy a dog. How come you never raised Annie and me with any religious background? Your mother and I thought you should make your own decisions about faith when you're ready. But do you believe in God at all? Like, like if you hurt someone and you don't take responsibility, he knows about it. Because if that's true, we can't really get away with anything, can we? What are you getting at? I'm just saying, you can lie to yourself, your friends, your family, but you can't lie to God. So the only thing to do is confess, right? I guess all the really original work, it's, it's all young guys. Young guys? No, I mean, there are some women. Really? Who? There's a woman at Stanford. I can't remember her name, though. Sophie Germain? Yeah. I think I've seen her at meetings. But I don't think I've ever met her. She was born in Paris in 1776. Then I definitely never met her. 